Welcome back to Anderson Smoke Show. Today, we are at my parents' house on the Camp Chef Woodwind Wi-Fi 24, and we are gonna smoke some bologna sandwiches. Stick around, see how we do it. Be sure to subscribe to my channel and ring that bell so that you can keep up with the latest content. Like the video, write me a comment. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you wanna see me smoke next on this Camp Chef Woodwind Wi-Fi 24. But until then, let's get to smoking that bologna. All right, so for this bologna, we're gonna smoke it at 250 degrees. We've got this Camp Chef loaded up with a blend of pecan, hickory, and mesquite wood. Let's go ahead and get this thing fired up. All right, flip this down. It is already turned on. We're gonna hit the set temp. We are going to set this to 200. Uh, let's start it out at 225 degrees. We're gonna let this thing go through the startup procedure, get up to 225 degrees. But in the meantime, we're gonna go ahead and start preparing that bologna. All right, so what you see here is a five pound chunk of bologna. It still has some of that wax covering on it. I'm gonna go ahead and get that cut off, get a binder on it, get some seasoning on it. Come check it out. All right, I'm gonna start out here. I'm just gonna slip my slicing knife underneath and just get that started there. We will peel that paper, that wax paper off that bologna all right so we're gonna want to score this quarter inch deep and about one inch squares and I'm gonna cut in this direction all the way around and then I'm going to cut in this direction all the way around so let's go ahead and start and we only want about a quarter inch deep this is gonna help the smoke penetrate this is gonna help with the seasoning and the binder to get in there and it's good to have a nice sharp knife. Makes it really easy. We're just putting a little pattern on this bologna here. While I'm standing here, I can smell that Camp Chef firing up, smell that hickory wood. I think that honestly is one of my favorites. And we're gonna keep scoring this here. That smoke's really starting to billow out. It's working on that startup procedure there. That's fine. All right, we have made our way all the way around this bologna now. So let's go ahead and turn this. And we're gonna do the same thing. Now it's easiest if you just roll the bologna and hold the knife pretty straight. Looks good. Now we're gonna turn it on its side and we're basically gonna do the same thing. I'm just gonna score it into kind of squares. And we'll turn that, do the same thing. We'll flip this over. Spin that around. We will score this side now. All right, you can see there, got that nice little checkered pattern there on that meat. All right, so the next thing that we wanna do is apply a binder, and I'm going to use some of the French's yellow mustard. I'm going to flip this thing on its side, and I don't need a ton, but I'm just gonna lather this up with some of that mustard there. Mm -hmm. 
Now that we've got that mustard as a binder on that bologna, we've got some of these Suckle Busters Honey Barbecue Rub. This stuff is great. I'm gonna go ahead and I am going to sprinkle this on here. Now, a lot of times with meat, you're gonna go ahead and pat that down with your hand, but since we're using that binder, there's really no need to do that. All right, we've got the binder and that Suckle Busters Honey Barbecue Rub on the bologna. The Camp Chef is up to 225 degrees. I decided to go with a little bit lower temperature with this. Let's go ahead and get this thing opened up. And I am just going to carefully place this bologna right in the center of this Camp Chef. Now one of my favorite features of this Camp Chef is being able to independently set the temperature and the smoke. And for this bologna, let's kick up the smoke. Come in here, let's do it. All right, in order to set the smoke, I'm gonna hit the button. We're gonna go down to set smoke. Let's crank this up to, uh, let's say five. We've got the bologna in. It's set to 225 degrees, smoke setting five. We're gonna go ahead and leave this bologna in until we hit about 145 degrees internal temperature. We'll check in a few times along the way. See you then. All right, we've had this bologna in at 225 for about an hour. I'm gonna go ahead and kick this up to 250 degrees on the grill. We're gonna finish it up at that. It's gonna be a few more hours. We'll check in periodically, let you see what we're working with. All right, let's go ahead and just take a look at what's going on in here. Starting to get a little color. You can see it's starting to separate a little bit where we cut into the meat. Looks good. All right, we've reached an internal temperature of 130 degrees on this bologna. We've got some of the Lily's Carolina barbecue sauce. I'm gonna go ahead and get my first round of sauce onto this bologna. Why don't you come on in? All right, that bologna, got those nice little separations there, looking good. Got that Carolina barbecue. I am just going to start by drizzling that on. And I've got this brush. Just start brushing this on. All right, we're gonna go ahead and get this thing closed up. We're gonna let that bologna continue to smoke. We wanna hit about 145 degrees or so. We'll probably hit it with a round of sauce again when we got about five degrees left. We'll see you then. We hit 145 degrees internal temperature on this bologna. It is time to take it out. I'm gonna go ahead, pop this thing open. I'm gonna yank on that probe and set it off to the side here. Go ahead and pull this thing off. All right, let's go ahead and slice this up. This 
bologna's all sliced up. It looks good. It's nice and juicy. I think we need a little bit of, a little bit of heat on it though. I say we come over here, crank the grill up to about 400 degrees for a few minutes, throw a few of those slices on, put a few grill marks on them. I think they'll be perfect. Go in here, set temp, bump that up to about 400. All right, we've got this bologna here. We're gonna go ahead, got this set to uh, 400 degrees. I'm gonna pick up a couple slices of this bologna. I'm gonna lay it right down on that hot grill. A nice little sizzle. Get a few more pieces here. Take this guy right there. Couple more. One last one, since there is five of us here today. I take a little bit of my barbecue sauce. Take a little bit here. Not a lot, just a little. Give that just a moment or so, and we'll flip them over to the other side and call it a day. All right, let's get in here. Let's flip these over. Yeah, look at that. Oh yeah, got some grill marks on it, yeah. Yeah, little bit more sauce. Another moment on this side and it'll be time to eat. All right, let's go ahead and pull these ones off. All right, we are done on the grill for today. We're gonna go ahead and turn it off. So we're gonna go to the shutdown mode. Hit shutdown, confirm. And the grill over the next 20 minutes will go through, stop feeding pellets. It'll continue the fan. It'll stop everything, we'll be good to go. All right, it is time to make a sandwich here. I'm gonna take me that end cap. I, I'm, I like the looks of that. I'm gonna set that right down on this deluxe hamburger bun. Look at that. All right, it is time to give this smoked bologna sandwich a try. I'm pretty excited about this. I haven't had a good bologna sandwich in a while. Mm. It's odd to say that bologna is tender, but that is really tender. It melts right in your mouth. Mm. That barbecue sauce is the perfect combination of sweet and tangy. It goes really well with this sandwich. I'm really impressed with what this camp chef could do with a bologna sandwich. I think this is great. Great summertime, easy, cheap meal. We're gonna start eating. See you next time. Thanks again for tuning in to Anderson Smoke Show. Be sure to like the video and subscribe to my channel so that you can keep up with the latest content.